Hazel was taking me to see the bombed out ruins of one of Escobar's many holiday homes on the outskirts of Medellin. That is the Hacienda, La Manuela. Oh my God. All the legacy yeah. is just stones and dust. It's a ghost, as I'm telling you. Yeah. I didn't expect it to be so emotive. You know, like, I don't know, it just looks... It's creepy, like eerie. It's an uneasy feeling seeing that, isn't it? It's weird. She's Let's go. Let's go, yes, sure. Do you feel, you know, we hear a lot of negatives about Pablo. Do you feel that there were any positive effects that he had on Colombia? Generó mucho empleo. Acá fuimos más de 200 empleados. Eh, construyó casas en Medellín para la gente más humilde. Por eso allá hay un barrio que se llama el barrio Pablo Escobar. Construyó placas polideportivas, centros de salud. Eh, me pareció una persona muy seria, eh, muy parca al contestar. Eh, se limitaba a contestar sí o no, pero no era de los que entrara pues, como en diálogo, así como una persona que no tuviera como mucha confianza. ¿Seguimos? Sí. ¿Continuamos? Sí. Acá iba a ser la casa principal, no se alcanzó a terminar. En todo el centro había un patio al aire libre con una fuente. Ahí fue donde colocaron la dinamita. Eh, no se destruyó en su totalidad la casa porque las paredes y los pisos son dobles. Lo hizo para su seguridad. ¿Were any of your family and friends affected by everything that went on around Pablo Escobar and the sort of general fear in the country? Gracias a Dios. En esa guerra no perdí familia, pero sí le dolía mucho porque todos los colombianos somos hermanos y morir tantos inocentes eso no es fácil. And do you feel that Colombia now has left this part of its history behind and is on to, you know, completely on to a positive path now? Pues yo la veo como algo que fue muy negativo, pero que nos que lo positivo que veo en el momento es que nos visita mucha gente y que hay un dicho pues muy cierto que el que no conoce de la historia está como condenado a repetirla. I mean this is proper mad because like you sort of I mean this would have been his main bedroom. It's a weird feeling because this is paid for through drug money, essentially, you know, you sort of, you can't help, as you're walking around, the fact that you're walking around bombed ruins, that brings into sort of sharp focus the fact that this was funded through some pretty horrible stuff. But, on the flip side of the coin, I mean, it, it is an amazing house. Like, that, there's a pool over there. I mean, it's like a super villain's pad. That, you can't get away from that. And that makes you feel, I don't know, it doesn't, make, it doesn't make you feel guilty a little bit, I guess. You know, you're sort of, I'm glamorizing it in my head. Never mind it being glamorized for me. I'm glamorizing it in my head. Walking around, though, you cannot avoid thinking about it, you know, thinking about the reality of it. La Manuela is open to the public, and tourists are able to wander the ruins, hear about Pablo's legacy, and afterwards, play paintball in the grounds. Oh. 
son of a bitch. Oh, oh shit! The chuck, the chuck! Ah! <laughs> Do you think doing paintball warfare on Pablo's holiday home might be accused of glamorizing violence a bit? Well, actually, this is something that people play normally, so. Jesus shit! <laughs> Go, 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 I'm not saying that I oh, love it, but shit! I can. Are you okay? <laughs> I you can prick. say that I love it, but I just uh, a pretty aware. Oh my god! I'm... Shit! Oh! Oh my god! Down! 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 Oh my god! No! No! Oh! I just... How is this prick getting me? Sorry. Yes, I'm listening to you. Carry on. I cannot just be negative and just complain about everything. The good part is the people who just get interested in Colombia and discovering things that they had never imagined, so I don't want to say it's a bad thing, 